Hello everybody, welcome into the Shadow Seeks Justice YouTube channel. I am the Shadow, and today I would like to present evidence to you, my subscribers, in regards to the Delphi, Indiana murder case. And I would also like to present evidence to the Indiana State Police and the FBI who are working on the Delphi, Indiana murder case of Liberty German and Abigail Williams, which occurred on February 13th of 2017 in Delphi, Indiana. Now, I'd like to enter into exhibit number one here, this video dated 11-10-2021. This is the sketches of the murder suspect that was put out by Indiana State Police. The Indiana State Police also put this photograph out of the bridge guy on the bridge, walking on the bridge. Now, I was able to zoom in and pull up bridge guy's real face, and here's the picture of bridge guy's real face. Now, I was able to do this with a filtering process, which I will only discuss with law enforcement what that process entails. And then I focused even more on Bridge Guy's face here in the pulling up of the structure and detail of Bridge Guy's face. And I believe here I have found critical information uh, that is very important to the case within the Delphi, Indiana murder case. Bridge Guy has a medical condition here affecting the eyes. Now, I would like law enforcement to focus on the eye area here, the substantial offset of the two eyes. Now, this condition is called strabismus. It is a condition in which your eyes point in different directions. Usually, one eye is pointing straight ahead, and the other eye is pointed in a different direction. Now, this condition is treatable. And um, sometimes it may include glasses or uh, eye exercises or uh, medication or surgery. Um, now, they can go back in surgically and align the two eyes so that they will be in perfect alignment. Bridge Guy's eyes are not perfectly aligned. They are offset and he has this condition, strabismus. Now, the condition uh, may be present from childbirth and usually shows up around uh, identifiable within about the uh, age of three years old. Now, this condition also can present itself in adulthood. Uh, it, this condition is due to a neuromuscular control, um, poor eye muscle control. Uh, and also, the can be uh, they can have uh, be far sighted as well in their eye condition. Now, this is critical information here uh, that would help to identify Bridge Guy. Only four percent of the United States population has this condition, and this now rules out 96% of everyone else within being a suspect to the Delphi, Indiana murders uh, within the Delphi, Indiana case. Um, we'd also like to uh, present our source of information, uh, information sources that you can go to to look up this information is Google and or maybe even Wikipedia, but definitely Google. And we'd also like to tell law enforcement that we the sketches do not reflect Bridge Guy's true face. The sketches do not reflect Bridge Guy's true face. Now, the real evidence here is the our hero, Liberty German, who took the video of bridge guy on the bridge this is the real evidence the photograph is the real evidence we want law enforcement to now focus on the photograph here we believe bridge guy is highly identifiable 
Bridge Guy is highly identifiable at this point in time. And we ask the FBI and the Indiana State Police to now focus on Bridge Guy's picture that the hero of this whole story, Liberty German, took of the suspect, the video and pictures that she took of the suspect on the bridge on February 13th of 2017. I now enter this information as evidence within the Delphi, Indiana murder case of Liberty German and Abigail Williams. Let today be the day. Justice for Abby and Libby. I am the Shadow. Thank you for watching.